if I go back three years, I'm like, oh shit, there's some definite mistakes. It's completely self-taught. And it's trial and error, because I never have deleted anything that I've recorded ever. You know, I'm constantly learning. I feel like I learn new stuff all the time still. I mean, I've done a lot of records that have had national success, but when I listen to records that I think are, like, truly, like, classic, not just from a songwriting standpoint, but sound-wise, like, oh, I've still got a long ways to go. And I don't think I'll ever get there, because it's a lifelong pursuit. You know, the sounds of the drums on Nirvana when Dave Grohl, like on In Utero, those are perfect sounds that there's no way I could ever get there because it's not the same person, it's not the same drum set, it's not in the same room, it's not the same quality of songwriting. Maybe it's better songwriting in certain ways, but, you know, there's just these magic things that happen that stick in your brain that's like, oh, this is the best of the best. I want to always be hungry, and I don't want to feel like, oh, I just have it, and I'm perfect, and everyone's a home run. Because if I did, it wouldn't be fun anymore. I'm from southeastern Iowa, so I came to Iowa City before deciding I was going to be an engineer out of just a love of music. Nobody can turn business away right now. Um, as the technology's gotten better, hundreds of records released every day now because anybody can make a record. It's so easy to make a record now that I feel extremely lucky. I'm probably the busiest in the state of Iowa. I will take work from anywhere, and I will record anything. People have come from all over to record here. I did a record that came out in January. Eraserata is a band from San Francisco, and Mission Creek funded that record. I record maybe 50 record full lengths a year, because I record full time. There will never be, there can never be, artists as big as there were before. Artists that you've heard of a million times or you know through and through, there will never be another Michael Jackson. There will never be another Beatles. Not because there won't be somebody that talented, but because there's no institution that can bring something to that level again.